Oh, hello. Mmm, lovely, aren't they? I've collected gnomes since I was a lad. My family said it was unhealthy. It made me take stock of my life. And I realised I had to make a change. So, I cut off all contact with them. <laughs> now it's just me and the gnomes. They're my best friends, especially Jonathan. He's like a brother. I, I would actually die for him. It's his birthday today, you know. I ordered a special present for him and everything, but it, it, it never got here, unfortunately. But you, you couldn't find out what happened to it for me, could you? Great, great! Now, this package, like I said, it's very special. I ordered it from a catalogue. It was very expensive, but then this is Jonathan we're talking about. He deserves only the best. Now, according to the catalogue, the delivery coach travels through Misspeak Valley. Maybe they lost a wheel there or something. It, it's a good place to start looking around, anyway. Ah, hello? But that worthless hunk of still. Lovely, that is. We Next time, dodge the bullets. How hard can it be? Watch it. find anything better in all of Brightwell than the stuff I'm selling You got it! Oh, this is brilliant! Brilliant! You see, Jonathan, I told you, didn't I? Oh, this is going to be amazing. This is going to be so mind-bogglingly amazing. People are going to say, right, this is mind-bogglingly amazing. Put it in the place of honor, would you? Right, let me see. Now then, here are the instructions. Prepare your display area in pride of place. Mm -hmm. Done that. Ensure that your garden ornaments are facing your gargoyle with unbroken line of sight. Mm -hmm. Check. Face your gargoyle. Stand confident. Take a deep breath and say in an authoritative voice. Oh. <clears throat> Gargolus multipulus. Don't play with matches. Don't eat wild mushrooms, they could be toadstools. You should never move an injured person. Always look both ways before crossing a road. Oh, this is the greatest day of my life! Wait until I tell my family. Oh, I forgot I stopped talking to them. Oh, who cares about them? This is mind-bogglingly amazing! In 
the morning when I wake up and I stumble out of bed. I put my pointy hat on my little pointy head. And it doesn't much matter if the sky is rain or shine. Because an ominous hat is almost all the time. They said a gnome is a happy fellow almost all the time. They said a gnome is a happy fellow almost all the time. Oh, I travel round the land and wherever I roam. From the mountains in the distance to the middle of my home. I raise my head and say in a loud resounding voice. Be in the middle of this horse. All the gnomes on the right say, pointy little hat. Pointy little hat, pointy little hat. And all the gnomes on the left say, two foot tall. Two foot tall, two foot tall. And again, lads. In the morning when I wake up and I stumble.